Welcome back to All Heart. As many of you know, I love, 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 love music, so I took the first chance that I had to invite my friends from the Recording Academy, the Philadelphia chapter, Mark Schultz and Ashley Coleman here. Many of you know it as the Grammys, but it's the Recording Academy. We're here to talk Grammy camp, music, and other stuffs. <laughs> as other my music kid. stuff. Other music stuff. I'm so glad you guys are here. Thanks we're for having us. Glad to be here. Um, so the first thing we're going to talk about, which is really cool, um, you don't have to be in the music business. You can have a, a kid that's an aspiring musician. It's the, called the Grammy Camp. Tell everybody about the Grammy Camp. Correct. So uh, Grammy Camp is part of our Grammy Foundation, which is one of our charitable or organizations within the Recording Academy umbrella. Um, so we give students the opportunity to go to four different cities this year, um, to either Nashville, St. Paul, New York, or Los Angeles, to learn more about the music industry from the business side or from the creative side. There's music journalism, engineering, um, anything you can find it there. And you just have to be a high school student. High school, so 13 to it's eight. from ninth grade to 12th grade. Okay. Um, and you can be a graduating senior as well to take part because it's over the summer. And how do you find out about it? You Do you have to apply? and you, There's an application process. Applications are due by March 31st. So get them in. Just Google Grammy Camp. You'll find it. It pops up. And it's a pretty easy application process. Pretty cool. And how many people about get actually get to go and be part of it? In each city, they have... Right, it depends. Okay. So LA is where it started, so that's one of the biggest camps. Um, probably about like 30 to 40 students. I don't mm -hmm. want to like be off-putting, but um, yeah. <laughs> it's a good amount, and that's yeah. why they opened it up to different markets so that they could service more students in different areas. It's a great, it's a great, great opportunity for like Absolutely. kids to get a taste of the music business. Right, and it's hands-on. So cool. Yeah. So this year at the Grammy Awards, uh, we learned about it about a year ago, um, that they were going to give an actual special Grammy Award to uh, an educator in music, which, which everybody that's in music or that's studied has that teacher that they love that right. sort of inspired them to get going. And um, they're going to give it again. Yes. The person that won it um, this past year was um, a very cool guy, right? Amazing personality. Yeah. And it's like this is the quintessential music teacher, unbelievably enthusiastic, ran like three different orchestras and all mm -hmm. these different youth music programs within the school. Um, perfect. Uh, and and very cool looking. He had the, he had whole, the full beard. Full right. on beard yep. going and, and super Very cool so. looking. So um, this year they're giving it out again. So right. people at, sitting at home, if you have a teacher that you right. love. You, you can, can nominate your music teacher. If you are a music teacher, you can nominate yourself, someone that's teaching your, your you know, son or daughter. Uh, again, March 31st is the deadline for this as well. And uh, GrammyFoundation.org uh, is where you can find out more information. But um, yeah, last year was our first year. It's taken us a little bit to figure out how to do this correctly. We thought we would have a few applications. We had mm -hmm. 30,000 applications. Uh, we had two semifinalists from this area, so it's, it's very exciting. Who doesn't love their music teacher? Exactly. They Absolutely. love it. They love it. So <laughs> there's so many things going on with Grammy all the time, and a lot of people would be surprised to know that there is a chapter right here in Philadelphia. Yep. If you're a student, you can get involved, and if you're a pro in the area, you live here, you can get involved too and tell people a little bit about what, it's, what it is and how they can get into it. We are essentially a professional membership organization. So our, our members are music makers, professional music makers, and those are the folks that vote for the Grammys. And you mentioned the students. Uh, for our college students, we have Grammy U, which is a membership specific to them to help them connect between what they're learning in school and, and working the professional world. Uh, so it's, it's a great opportunity for them to interact and to network with people who could potentially be their, their mentors or their boss or their mm -hmm. partners in a new business. And, you know, around year in Philadelphia, there's a lot of cool events that, that uh, the Recording Academy puts on, like workshops. Absolutely. And mm -hmm. tell me a little bit about the things that um, happen during the year. Well, we basically do professional development and networking for the music industry professional and, as Mark mentioned, the college students. So one of our big things coming up is our Future Now Music Conference. Mm -hmm. May 10th is the date for that. So we're going to put together a series of great panels for independent artists that need to know whether you're independent or signed to a major. It's just, it's going to be a wealth of information to take your career to the next level. So if you want to learn, that's the place you could. Do you have to be a member to go, or you is it open to the public? It's open to the public. Yep. Which is really, really great. You, Absolutely. And you just came back from the Grammy Awards recently. Uh, yes, we give me some dish. We give me some dish on the Grammy Awards. <laughs> <laughs> well, we got to dress up really nice, right? Uh -huh. Got to dress up warmer than here, unfortunately. Uh -huh. yes. And enjoy the weather. And how much do we love Pink's performance? Our girl local Pink, girl. Yep. our local girl. Absolutely. Amazing. This show Absolutely. was really great. What was your favorite moment this year? That might have been it. 
Pink. That might have been it. Well, I'm so glad that you guys came by. I hope you'll come visit us again. Absolutely. Mark Schultz and Absolutely. Ashley Coleman from the Recording Academy. Grammys, thank both of you for being here. So don't go anywhere because when we come back, we're going to take a look at what's in the theaters this weekend. But before we go, to take a break, take a look at some of the cool music concerts and events happening around town this weekend.